Hello everyone, and welcome back to Fallout 4. I'm Lord Fort. Um, we've just managed to recapture the castle and stuff. And I've got to turn off that radio because it's going to drive me nuts. Oh wait, it's not on. <laughs> okay. Just get out of here. Um, at the end of the last episode, we got a couple help people missions, so we probably should go do some of those. Because um, clearly we are not capable of progressing too much further in the story at the moment. We're about, as far as I can tell, about halfway done. Um, as far as I can tell, we're about halfway done with the story. Um, we're about 13 or so hours in, and it's about a 26 hour long story. If you rushed it, obviously I'm not rushing it. So it might take me a little longer. Okay, let's go find this nursery place where they're having issues. Hopefully we don't get ourselves killed by some weird... Boy, that thing's tanky. Okay. Let's go talk to these people and help them deal with their issues. Double check it, there's nothing right there to kill me. There always seems to be something to kill you in this game. Okay, this looks like our destination. Green Top Nursery discovered. You've got to help. They've kidnapped my husband. Just tell me what happened. They I really need to replace to this helmet. If sure. Um. I'll get him back. We asked the Minutemen for help, but I didn't right. just bring him. Uh-huh. Okay. We've got a new mission now. Oh, okay. It's way down there. Uh. Okay. <laughs> it's a bit of ways away to kidnap somebody. We seem to have stumbled right into the midst of a firefight. <laughs> Everything's exploding and burning around us. Uh, problem is we have to really get to the other side of this fight in order to reach our goal. Sounds like someone's got a machine gun. Or, the other option is we wait it out, see which side wins, and finish them all. An integrated swarm bot. Nope. It's got a skull. We just fought another skull enemy and nearly got annihilated several times. I'm gonna go and say no skull enemies for a while. So I may have to kill that mutant hound. If I can, wow. a super mutant, but it didn't attack me. Huh. 
Oh, I can't see him anymore. Hoping to get a good snipe or two off, but wherever they've disappeared to, they are not visible. There is a super mutant right there. Yeah, you weren't crazy. Guys comment, I swear I'm not going crazy, and then one of them gets their heads blown in. Aren't we nice? I'll make it nice and quick. You can trust me. There you are, you little bastard. Ah, shoot. Okay, good thing I'm around this corner, because the dog just got obliterated. There's a machine gun up there. Did they just... They just... Hit themselves with that fire, it looks like. Somewhere, right there, is the machine gun. As I'm targeting it, and I don't see... Oh, there it is. Bullseye. Well, not really a bullseye, but you know what I mean. Problem solved. Where this is super mean right there. Found where I was going to. Let's turn off searchlights and any turrets there may be. It would be nice if you could hack the uh, turrets and have them work for you, but it doesn't seem to be a feature. Out of the way, dog. Oh, hostage rescue mission. Always a fun thing, right? I just hope this adventure into a raider building doesn't end with a death claw in the basement. Okay. What I really would like would be some silence, like pistols and stuff, which I don't have. Wow, that person was not going down. Person went down really easy. Honestly, more concer concerned about the machine gun than the legendary radar, although. Legendaries always are a pain. Oh. 
Okay, he's mutated. Time to swap weapons. Got him. And level 21. What do we want? Uh, we can do 10% more damage. We can save two crit hits. I still want to obviously focus into luck, but unfortunately we have we've kind of gotten the base stuff. I could get more bottle caps. Uh, I could do more with rifles. Do bank level one armor or a level three gun mods. I think we should probably take the gun mod, honestly. Not luck, but anything that gets us better stuff, I think is a good idea. Keep your eyes open. I think this asshole's using a stealth boy. Uh, totally not using a stealth boy. I'm just not walking out in the open. Also, I really looking for a better helmet. Come on out. I'll make it nice and quick. You can trust me. Exterminate's pipe bolt axe and pistol. And not really useful, but we've got a muffled welder's raider's right arm. Obviously it's gonna be worse than what we have, but I was just you know, always worth looking at. At some point, I want to do some stealth stuff. I just haven't really been able to yet. Food, I guess. I find it funny that mirrors are some of the best loot in the game. Did that dog just do like a karate back kick or something? Like a dog foo or something? Because that was pretty crazy. I think the guy blocked while the dog was in mid dive or something. Ah, cooking. Let's do some cooking. Look how, I wonder what the people whose base we just invaded are thinking. He's, this guy broke in, killed off of our, half of our friends, and then just sat down and started cooking. <laughs> A little weird. Here's the person I've been sent to rescue. Okay, rescued him. Okay, somehow he'll uh, apparently get out of here alive, so I don't have to worry about helping him out. It's just a matter of looting everything now. That's where I started. You know, you really don't need to follow me around, the person I saved. The other thing we definitely need to do is remember to up our lockpicking skills so we can get in some places. Keep forgetting to do that. Oh, we've got a protector tron. There we go. Oh, first time. Got a safe, cool. That's it. Hmm, bad. Now 
Yuck. Protect and serve. Uh, we can leave there, but I kind of want to. I kind of want to check upstairs before I leave, just to make sure I've gotten any loot. This feels like an area it might have, like, a bobblehead or something. Plus more loot. Or there's a machine gun right there. Walk around the corner, find a machine gun. Yeah, standard day in the Commonwealth. That's kind of funny. Bullet displays. Missile. This seems to be game seems to be giving me a lot of missiles. Oh, we've got, now that we've got weapons mods, right? We could probably do something here. Actually, to be fair, I probably don't have the uh, needed uh, loot on me. What I really would like to do would be get like a um, depressor or something, but that requires level two. Great to get a silence thing. Yeah. We'll go back to Sanctuary after this, probably, and see if we can do stuff. Uh. Someone was writing poetry. We still haven't found the person called Griswold, so... Hey. Oh, I missed him. seem to be any other enemies here really. I think that was the last one. Got the plaza key though. Out of the way dog. The dog it's really an annoying companion isn't it? Sleep. Got some metal legs. Well, we'll keep the uh, we'll keep the metal legs just because um, they're shadowed right now. At some point, we want to try and do some stealth. Nope, that's all we can do. I don't want to build the robot um, repair stuff. Not worth it. Okay, they've mined the stairs here then. And there's nuclear waste there. Okay. Well, successful rescue mission. Barely had to kill anybody. Um, and more importantly, the person didn't die. So, I think I can call that a win. Leveled up. Now we can do gun mods. So I think we want to try and uh, improve what we have. So right now we're not doing a lot of damage. Basically, outside of the sniper rifle and the energy weapon I've got, we don't really do any damage with pistols. I mean, I could take some pistol ranks, but really, the pistol feels really weak in terms of damage, so I don't think I will. Okay, I'm just going to fast travel back to this um, 
nursery and then uh, turn it in and then we'll probably go back to sanctuary. Okay. Where are you, person? Ah, you're in the greenhouse. But we gotta loot some on my way by. I don't know how to thank you for that rescue you pulled off. Just remember that this is all thanks to the Minutemen. Oh, we know. <laughs> okay. So, uh, talk to Preston, who's probably all the way back at Sanctuary again. He's now managed to march across the map for like a third time. Pretty sure I could do this game on survival mode, except for the fact that traveling between everywhere takes forever since you can't fast travel. Hello, sir. Okay, Preston. Give me XP, please. I rescued that kidnapped settler. We've got another settlement on our side now. Good. Another win for the Minutemen. Keep it up, and pretty soon we'll have the whole Commonwealth behind us. I'll let you know if I hear of any settlements that need our help. In the meantime, make sure to offer help to anyone that needs it. That can only help our cause. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Quarter of a level. Got something a bit different. Oh, here we go. Scouts have found a problem. Clear it out. New settlement. Uh -huh. Okay, let's... Uh, Sun Signs Tidings Co-op. Okay, let's quick drop loot and stuff. Um, I also want to put away the shadowed stuff I've got with me. That... There was another shadowed one we had, but maybe I'm just crazy. Oh, so that's all of them. Okay, let's see if we can craft any mods for this stuff. Uh, we could do a bayonet. What I really want is that suppressors. Um, Kellogg's pistol, we could do a short scope. It's a little bit more valuable, a little bit heavier. Yeah. But you got a comfort grip, bold barrel. It's a pretty good weapon, actually. That's hardened already, that's long. Medium scope, yeah, the sniper rifles we've got are pretty solid. Like, it's already given us some of the better mods on our weapons. Um, can't mod that. Why can't build that? Oh, I don't have enough screws. Where the heck do I find screws? Huh. Do that. Increased accuracy, slightly reduced range, sure. Nothing great. In fact, we've already got pretty much the best stuff we could get on it. So, maybe we don't even need to do the level 2 stuff? I don't know. Uh, well, that's going to be it for this episode. Next episode, we will go clear the Sunshine's Tiding Co-op, I imagine. And that is right over there. So, we will go do that next episode, and I'll see you all then. Bye for now.